gets another very good start, but also going well is Nesta Carter right alongside him, and so is Leron Clark, and Clark might just have this. Clark gets it! 6.47, and there's the quick time for you, but not for Powell. It's for this man, the Commonwealth champion, Leron Clark, stole the win ahead of his two teammates, and the... One, two, three, got switched around, if you like. It should have been this man. They thought it would be this man. I think he's going to have to settle for third, perhaps, but no doubt about our winner. And a new personal best for Lerone Clark. Carter had the lead for a while, but it was Clark who finished the quickest, finished the strongest. And it was all about the Jamaicans, undoubtedly, but the surprise winner. Maybe not to him, but I'm sure to lots of people. It was going to take something under 6.5. Once again, Powell can't quite deliver. Well, Colin, he didn't get out badly, Powell, did he? But just nothing much really didn't didn't get moving quickly enough and they left it to Carter and Clark. Yeah, you're right, Steve. You know, that shows a little bit of, uh, of being ring rusty. You know, he hasn't raced at all that much over 60 metres and that's really what shows there. While Clark himself has had many races and you can see his experience of having tight races sold him right the way through there. Out the blocks, we, we expect Clark to be really explosive. He's short, he's compact, he's Commonwealth champion, we know how good he is. But Carter was on him very quickly. Asafa was always trying and reaching all the way, but they couldn't quite get up to, to Clark's performance. A new Jamaican record. He